Today, our News 8 Storm Team forecast says mostly sunny to start, a little hazy sunshine out there. It's comfortable. Temperatures by 9 will be around 66. For the afternoon, a few more clouds bubble up, maybe a stray shower, but the top temperature should be the talker with a high of 80. Feeling fine. This evening, partly sunny, warm, 76. For tonight, we see partly cloudy skies, a seasonable night. Temperatures drop to the upper 50s. And tomorrow, partly sunny, pleasant, looking good here, 76 to 80, just a slight trim from today's highs. Taking a live look outside, you can see some of that wildfire smoke and haze on the horizon. It's 52 in Lancaster, 48 in York, 48 for Sealands Grove, and 56 degrees in Chambersburg. Wind speeds should be light throughout the day. Right now, they're generally calm, just a 5 mile per hour breeze in Sealands Grove, and that's about it. Let's look at our weather and health report. We have oak, mulberry, and grasses in our pollen count today. That is high. Air quality is moderate, and the UV index is going to be high with a burn time of 25 minutes. So we're starting out clear and dry around the region, but there's a very weak front that will be dropping south and kind of fizzling out over northern Pennsylvania today. So what that will do is provide a little lift to produce some cloud cover and maybe an isolated shower. Isolated being the key word here. They are not scattered around at all, not widespread. As we head into tonight, any showers fizzle. Tomorrow, mix of clouds and sunshine, feeling pretty good with that low humidity continuing. And then as we head into Wednesday, it'll be a sunny start for the day, but a stronger cold front drops in by evening. There it is, and that'll provide a better chance for a few showers for us Wednesday evening. Until then, forecast is looking pretty slim for those rain chances. Here's the 10 day forecast. You can see that we have numbers in the 70s for much of the week, lower 70s by week's end. Saturday's high is 76. Sunday, we have a few showers possible same deal for Memorial Day. We'll keep you updated on that developing forecast. And then next week, temperatures will hover right around the 80 mark as we start the week.